Hey guys, really windy. But this place is called the Palosi Pueblo. And uh, there is, I don't know if you can see a ridge here, and the one I'm standing on, and even this flat area. These are all structures that are now buried in time. And there is about a square mile of pottery and artifacts just strewn about in absolutely in abundance almost every style of quote unquote Anasazi painting and I'll just take you real quick for a walk through here and again, all these hills are actually buried buildings. And when you see rocks like this, you're looking at some of the original rocks making up the building. More patterns. More patterns. And as far as you can walk it, all the way over to that hill, this is another building. So we're gonna go check that out on the other side. There are just thousands of pieces of the black and white. And here, someone even has a nice little obsidian flake. Oh, yeah. And I'll take you down to Gremlin. Yeah. And we're just getting started to look around here. But it's basically just a huge archaeological dig that has never been dug here's the more building structure here and just off the edge of the building is nothing but shards and pottery on the black and white These are all tools that are being worked here. Super fresh. She's fresh. And you can see there's just pottery everywhere. everywhere. Getting mixed up. Each time it rains, the pottery runs down these washes. And here's more raw material from the making of arrowheads. And again, could be a prehistoric scraper. But just more of that Anasazi. More shards of raw material. I really can't see this. Oh, a nice little section. What is this? Bring it over. Finding. Yeah. And there's gray, there's solid gray, but then that's not pottery. No, that's a piece of basalt, basalt. they're bringing in here. Okay. Ooh, damn it. So, pretty awesome spot. And we're gonna Ooh, that's a high contrast stuff in there. spend a little time looking around. Yeah, let's get in the shade. Thanks for watching.